Hey everyone, this is Disc Junkie and today I'm going to show you another release of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This time it is a brand new spanking Blu-ray edition from Japan. And this was a really blind buy for me. I basically pre-ordered it, didn't have any info on the cover. But you know, new release from Japan, some Blu-ray, Texas Chainsaw, you know, I know I'm going to buy it anyway. Because I'm just a completist in that way. So. What I got is something that maybe didn't really live up to the price tag, which was like 500 Swedish crowns or something. You can just convert that because I forget what it was in dollars now. But still, I do think it is an interesting design and it doesn't actually look like everything else I've seen. Start by sliding this out. Glossy style diggy pack, matte printed, black slip case which has a cutout in the middle. There's no plastic here. Here is a closer look at the spine, closer look at the back, just plain black as is the top and bottom of the slipcase. This is a paper wrap around, the typical things which they wrap around Japanese editions, like a paper flyer. More of a classic back cover print where, you know, they print all the specs and it's all in Japanese here, so obviously you might not understand it, but this is sort of the way they uh, tend to do it in Japan for a lot of their releases. But anyway, moving on to the Digipack itself. It is a very colorful, luxurious looking print. Highly glossy, very detailed as you can tell. It is different from the other prints I've seen, which is cool. Here's just a closer look of the spine. Here is the back cover, also quite simple. Not really extremely graphic or, you know, uh, just a simple black and white print, but still, you don't really need more than that, do you? Here's just a small black and white flyer. And then we have the two discs. I'm actually gonna pop these out because I want to show you the uh, interior of the Digipack. A unique design, just a very sort of contrasty uh, black and white. And uh, yeah, I think this uh, interesting choice, which also is brand new. Uh, feels like they went with a really simplistic design here, which I think is, uh, I don't know, it's a nice mixed bag of different, uh, different styles. That is the barcode, which is on a sticker on the exterior plastic, but I put it there just to keep it. And last but not least, just taking a look at the two discs. Here is the bonus disc. Sorry that this is coming in first, but Jesus, I don't know why you would even care about the order of the disc. So that's that. Looking at the second one here, which is obviously the first one. <sighs> Try to stay with me. I know it's hard. So yeah, so you have all the little prints and stuff. And here's the overall look. So yeah, I was sort of hoping for a bit more than this based on the price tag and based on the fact that Japan generally does really luxurious stuff. I mean, to my surprise, this is the uh, anniversary edition, which actually came in uh, quite late. We've seen the uh, Black Maria edition and all of these really luxurious and different versions from various different countries that have already come out. And this was sort of surprisingly late for Japan. I mean, they are quite a uh, power to be reckoned with uh, in terms of the DVD and Blu-ray collecting scene and I was sort of thinking like are they not gonna release the anniversary edition for Texas Chainsaw? They have released this on VHS countless times. There are uh, various really really good looking and very luxurious looking special editions for DVDs in Japan and then all of a sudden it's like you're not doing an anniversary edition? What the fuck is wrong with you? But as luck would have it uh, they were just a little late in the game. Maybe not as luxurious as I would have liked it to be but who knows, maybe we will be seeing another deluxe box set uh, in the future. Who knows? But that's it for me today. Really hope you enjoyed this. And as usual, hope to see you all next time.